Welcome back, Dragon Age Origins. I have a problem with Gorum here. I guess there's a conflict with the mod between the vanilla game, well, the game and the mod I'm using. Oh well. Wait a bloody second. Well, I don't think I'm actually gonna be able to get any herbs, so. Yeah, I got too many skills on Goron. That's a problem. Oh. Right. Okay. Pick that. And that. Let's go. What about that one? I doubt he's up to the task. I'm not going down that road. This should be easy enough. Oh, I would love to end On up it. with the red the head. Would that Sir Blackstone? Oh, we're noble. Mm -hmm. Stand up straight. They're coming. What have we here? Two handsome, strapping noble lords. You both look so grand. And isn't this the man of the hour, the king's son? Who's your friend, my lord? Another noble from the honored house I duke in? This is Sir Gorham of the warrior cast. Oh, then not a noble? No, Telly, not a noble. Stone your thick sometimes. Why do you care if Gorham is a noble? They're noble hunters, my lord. A man takes his cast from his father, and these women hope to bear a noble lord's son. If one is successful, she's raised up to concubine in the noble house to care for her child. It provides new sword arms for the house, and many nobles look favorably on such women. Sounds like a good deal to me. Shall I come to your chambers after the ceremony, then? I talked to him first. I want him. He's looking for a woman, Telly, not a little girl. I'm Marty, and I know how to give my lord a night he'll remember. Do I really have to pick just one? Oh, my lord has his energy about him. There will be no three to a bed, if that's what you're thinking. We both require full experiences all to ourselves. If you think you can manage us both, though... Both of you it is. This should prove most interesting. We will wait for you together, my lord. And show you the proper way to celebrate a princely commission. Mm-hmm. Greetings, my lord Idukin. I am so honored to have you visit my booth. I have a proposition, but I dared not approach. Yet you dare now. It's all right, I'll hear him out. Very well then, speak. Um, yes, just so. Here's the thing. What I mean to say is... Spit it out. Sorry. So nervous. I had a dagger made for you as a gift for your first command. I uh, sent a messenger to deliver the dagger to you. Prince Trian had him thrown out. I don't know what offense he caused, but I had him beaten severely. Let me see this dagger. Here, here it is, your highness. That's an amazing piece, merchant. You do me much honor, sir. The blade has been crafted over a period of two years by masters of every art. I wish to bless the Lord's first command and hope that someday, when he rules, he will wear it. Tree and his heir. He will rule when King Endrin returns to the stone. If the assembly wills it. Forgive me, sir, but whispers say the second child of Endrin will be chosen. Whispers indeed. It's a princely gift. If Trian recognizes it, though, it may send the wrong message. Or the right one, depending on your view. I'll take the dagger. Thank you. You bring uncountable honor to me. What he means is that you'll bring uncountable gold to him if you wear that piece in public. Sounds like a fair deal. I get the dagger, he gets money. Alright. Wait. Hmm. My lord, are you heading to the Proving Arena? Yes, I intend to watch the Provings. We have been charged with the task of escorting you to the Proving Grounds. I clean forgot about that. Forgive me, I should have informed you sooner. 
The king decided you were not to travel through the commons unguarded. I am quite capable of walking safely to the proving. I did mention the merchants that won permits to show their goods in the diamond quarter. There were only so many permits auctioned off, and quite a few were turned away. Your father fears you will be harassed on the way to the proving. Excellent, I grow weary of these merchants. Will we be leaving then? Yes. We are at your command. Highness, it is an honor to have you here. Have you come to watch these brave warriors do battle in your honor? No, I've come to fight. Your Highness, this proving is in your honor. Then honor him by doing as he says. My Lord Idukin will fight in this proving. I'll honor today's warriors by testing their skills. Of course, it is well within your rights. Men and women of Orzammar, we have a late entry to these provings, held on the eve of battle for the honor of House Iduken. I give you the Lord Iduken himself! Are you ready for your first match? Of course. Then let us begin! This is a glory proving. Fought under the watchful eyes of the Paragons of Orzammar for the honor of House Iduken. Lord Iduken will fight Aler Bimo, youngest son of Lord Bimo. You honor me with this match. The honor is mine. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Senses too. Look at this! I love it! Quite a fight. Alair Bimo is no slouch with that hammer. Are you ready for your next opponent? Yes. Excellent. Let us go. This is a glory proving. Fought under the watchful eyes of the Paragons of Orzammar. For the honor of House Iduken. Lord Iduken will fight a dull Helmi. Eldest daughter of Lady Helmy. Honor and glory to your house, your highness. And to yours. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Okay. That was a crowd pleaser. Many were waiting to see that woman put in her place. Sir Blackstone is your next opponent. Are you ready to face him? I am. Then let us begin. This is a glory proving. Fought under the watchful eyes of the Paragons of Orzammar. For the honor of House Iduken. Lord Iduken will fight Sir Blackstone, Deep Road Squad Leader of the Warrior Cast. 
This is your education, child. Try to learn as you bleed. Good luck to you. First warrior to fall is vanquished. Fight! Mm hmm. Enemies approaching! Well done. You have proven that even the best of the warrior cast cannot match a noble Idukan. Frandland Ivo is your final opponent. He too has had many victories today. Are you ready to face him, or will you rest first? I am ready to fight. Of course. This is a glory proving. Fought under the watchful eyes of the paragons of Orzammar. For the honor of House Idukan. It is down to just two warriors. With backbones of stone and wills of iron, they have defeated all others this day. Lord Idukan will fight Franklin Ivo, second son of Lord Ivo. You fight well. I wish you glory today and glory tomorrow. May you be a stone. First warrior to fall is vanquished. The victor is champion. Fight! Mm -hmm. Time for the fun! Nice bug there. <laughs> that won me the match basically. Okay. Congratulations. Friend and Ivo is as fierce a competitor as I've ever seen. You vanquished every warrior of note in today's proving. The ceremonial helm, commissioned by your father for today's winner, is yours. I'll wear wear it proudly. Or yeah, I'll wear it. Your glory honors every warrior here. Mm-hmm. I'll need it. That's why I took it. I am playing a nightmare. I'm ready to leave. Your wish is our command. Let's go. That's approving. Look at this piece, darling. The Bible from the board. I should have used the no helm attack, but whatever. So that's done. The proving is done. Costinier, signing out.